Yeah, this book is really interesting. Yep. All right, well, <laughs> that's enough of that. Yeah, I could be doing anything else right now, but here I am at Blockbuster making my meager minimum wage. I'm just alphabetize this endless loop of movies and hopefully not. Ooh. Oh, I'm so sorry, Mrs. Harris. I didn't see you there. That's all right. You just knocked over all of my stuff. <laughs> well, can I help you find a movie or something? You know, I'll be here all night. No, no, I don't come here for the movies. I come here to people watch. And I like to dumpster dive in the back. You guys throw away the craziest shit. One time I found popcorn. It was like not even that old. Well, we also have movies and not stale popcorn. Mm-hmm, yeah. We also, oh, you know what? I don't really care about the movies, like I said. I'm good. So leave me the fuck alone. All I want is that sweet, delicious dumpster popcorn. And it will be mine. It will be mine. <laughs> Hey, dummy with the stupid curly hair. Yeah. Huh? Hey, over here. Come on. I know you hear me. Oh, jeez. My medicine is not working. No, your medicine's working just fine. I'm real and deal. Come on in and see me. Uh, you're real and deal? Well, listen, it's a euphemism. I'm Howie Mandel. You might have seen me from my promotional video. <laughs> that's, that's not you at all. Well, what do you want? Listen, I ain't nobody. I ain't somebody to be trifled with. <laughs> okay, all right. Listen, you like my bow tie? How about this? You're gonna get me out of this fucking TV screen, or I'm gonna choke you, and then I'm gonna make you scream. How about it? We got a deal, huh? Hey, listen, I'll make you fart, <laughs> and then I'm gonna make you cough. Why would you make me do all these things? Because. I like making noises. Noises are what makes me happy. And you know what? Oh, I'm not happy right now. So it's time to make some noise. <laughs> be quiet. I don't know why you want to make me fart and cough and shit, but you got to get out of here, bro. I'm trying to work. All right? I only get paid $2 an hour, so please. Oh, this is $2 an hour. It's actually two fifty. Yeah, whatever. Get out of here. You're going to get me out of the TV? Or Howie Mandel's going to strangle you by your throat, and then I'm going to make you explode. You're going to make me explode? Mm-hmm. Eat shit, Howie. You're not going to make me do anything. Oh? You're going to have to break this curse, lady. And I've got two strikes on you right now, so you got one more chance left. Sell some movies. Okay. And then I'll get you out of the TV? Good idea. Oh, and by the way, you got to sell at least 1,500 movies, and then I'll be free from this prison. How about it? Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Uh, Mrs. Harris, this guy in the TV, Howie Mandel, he said he's going to make me fart and cough and shit. And I have to sell movies or else I'm going to be killed. So, all right, well, uh, you, the medicine definitely seems to be not doing its job. So, um, I'm just going to grab these movies and go. Well, you gotta have to, you're going to have to buy some. I ain't buying shit, lady. That's why I'm here at Blockbuster. I'm going to rent. Well, maybe if I gave you some good ideas on movies to buy. You know, because I have to sell 1,500 movies. So I really don't want to have to die by Howie Mandel. <laughs> you are so kind of psycho. Tell you what, you have my interest. What were you going to try and sell me? Hmm? Well, go ahead. Give me some ideas. What should I buy? Should I buy Austin Powers, International Man of Mystery, or should I buy Dumb and Dumber? Well, they're both great picks. You can't go wrong there. Listen, I just don't want Howie Mandel to rip my face off. How about I suggest something here? This is like a dollar. All dogs go to heaven? Yeah. <laughs> well, all right. Yeah. Hey, Buster, you're going to have to sell a lot more movies than that if you want to get me off your ass. Buddy, you are not on my ass. You are in a TV screen. You can't do shit to me. How about that? Oh, I can't do shit, can I? How about this? I'm going to ring you by your little neck. And then what are you going to do, huh? And then I'm going to make you eat Play-Doh. And then I'm going to make you cough it up. And then I'm going to juggle you around like a basketball. And then maybe I'll shoot you through a hoop. And then maybe, maybe when I'm done with that, and you'll do what exactly, huh? Then maybe I'll make you spaghetti. But then I'm going to make you throw it up. And then I'm going to make you eat it again. You're disgusting, Howie Mandel. Leave me alone. Howie Mandel leaves nobody alone. Listen here, you little worm. You got one choice, and you better listen good. You're going to get me out of this TV, or you are going to become the Play-Doh itself. I'm going to mash you, grind you, and shoot you in your forehead. How about that? I am not somebody to be trifled with. Now take this movie and sell it. Oh, and sell this too. This is a book. 
Yeah, well, it just added on to the list. Our customers don't know how to read, Howie. How do you expect me to sell this? I can't. Not my problem, lady. Get on with it. Oh, wow. So there's this guy in the TV and... Oh, he didn't even want to hear my story. Hey, yeah, so there's this guy in the TV. Uh, I don't really care about this guy in the TV. I got me a whole bunch of VHS tapes. Look at them, boy. Look at all I got. I got a whole bunch of them. I, I can't wait to go home and watch them. Look at all I got. I got, I got the secret world of Alex Mack. I got, I got... Hey, hey, listen, listen. What now? I listen, I'm your schizophrenic nightmare. You're going to get me out. I really need to get out of here. Let's just bring you up so I can go, okay? What are you talking about? The movies. We're going to get you those movies so you can go. The guy on the TV, you just saw him, right? He, all right. Uh, just ring me up. Don't just rant by it. The guy, he told me, what? What? What are you talking about? I don't know anymore. I don't know. Did you know you could buy these VHS tapes? I just found that out. Yeah, I don't want to buy them. That's why I'm here. <laughs> well, you can. I'm just letting you know. Okay. Well, guess what? I don't care. I'm here to rent, not buy. And I don't want to rent. I mean, buy. I just want to, <laughs> I just want to rent my movie and get out of here. Let me out. All right. Hey, listen. You ever getting bit by a dog? Uh. No, not really. But I did one time get bit by a squirrel. And listen, that squirrel had rabies, and I had to get uh, the rabies sucked out with a pump. Wicked, radical. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I yeah, I never got bit by a squirrel. <laughs> but uh, yeah. hey, this is Jeb. Uh, Jeb, he also got bit by a squirrel, didn't you, Jeb? Uh, yep. Can I just start off by saying you're the worst salesperson I've ever seen? Oh, it's you, Howie. Yeah, it's me. All right. I don't think you like living. I don't think you appreciate. I don't think you don't think I do what now? I don't think you appreciate the generosity I'm giving here. I could kill you right now easily, but I'm choosing not to. Oh, you think you could do that, huh? And how exactly would you? Go on, explain. You well, it's very easy actually. I would just grab you like these two chocolate bars and snap them in half, kind of like your spine. Oh, give me a break, Howie. I just want to go home and then watch TV and go to bed. I don't have time to deal with this crazy guy on the TV. I really don't. Okay? So why don't you just go away, please? Not gonna happen. In fact, I'm gonna haunt you forever. <laughs>